A decision waits in the wings on a landmark trial concerning transgender care in Arkansas. Good evening and thanks for watching KRK4 News at 10. I'm Gary Burton Jr. After testimony from both sides, James Judge Moody will rule whether or not it is unconstitutional to enact a ban on transgender health care for minors in the state. Now, as we await the ruling, our Riley Birdwell caught up with people on both sides of the issue. Now, Riley, what did they have to say? Well, Gary, days after the trial wrapped up, people are still strongly divided on this issue. Tonight, I spoke with a state senator and a person who identifies as a transgender male. Two sides to one trial involving transgender youth. We're talking about lives here, children's lives. They're going to feel certain ways, but we're going to protect them from making a foolish choice while they're young. Senator Bart Hester and Lowen and Bryan have been following the court proceedings since the beginning. And now, waiting for the ruling, they have voiced their hopes for the future. Children should not be going under the knife to, to dismember them, to disfigure them in any way. Lowen Bryan, who identifies as a transgender man, says he wishes the state would leave the decision to the parents. Transition is a very personal decision to make, and that should be between the, that person. Bryan feels this issue is just discrimination based on their gender identity. It really saddens me that trans teens that are lucky enough to have parents that support them are now having to battle with the state. Meanwhile, Hester says this is a form of child abuse and protection Protecting children is top priority. And we're just not going to allow children to go under the knife that are going through a difficult time. Um, it's not appropriate. We don't believe it's appropriate. Now the ruling is in the judge's hands for now, and we could know the ruling or the results within the next few weeks or a few months. Reporting in studio, I'm Riley Birdwell. Back to you, Gary. All right, Riley.